YouTube channel Jago India. Please like, share and subscribe my channel. First of all, I wish you a very, very, very happy Mathematics Day. Math is not a subject. Math is way of life, right? If, ma if uh, schools were open and if this situation used not to be there, uh, we used to celebrate Mathematics Day with a great joy. But bad luck. This year we don't have uh, that facility. But I wanted to celebrate Mathematics Day. So I prepared some models in home and I wanted to share these models to you. First model is transversal. We know that transversal is a line which uh, goes along two, uh, two or more parallel lines. Here in this model, L and M are parallel lines for which N is a transversal which is going through these two parallel lines. This uh, transversal makes uh, eight angles with these parallel lines. Now I am going to say you about these eight angles or the properties of these eight angles uh, in this model. And the first one is uh, here comes the first one and here uh, the same color the same colored uh, angles are uh, 1 7 and angle 2 and angle 8 these angles are alternate exterior angles these alternate exterior angles are of equal degree. Uh, and the next one is alternate interior angles. As alternate exterior angles, alternate interior angles are also of same length, of same degree. See, angle 3 and angle 5 are one set of alternate interior angles and angle 4 and angle 6 are one pair of alternate interior angles. Now, going to the next set of angles and it is corresponding angles. Now, I am going to explain you about the corresponding angles. Here comes the same colored uh, angles are corresponding angles. Here, angle 1 and angle 5 are corresponding angles. Uh, like this, angle 4 and angle 8 is another pair of corresponding angles. Angle 2 and angle 6, angle 3 and angle 7. Uh, the property of these corresponding angles are, uh, the corresponding angles are of equal degree. Here we can see that angle 1 is equal to angle 5, like that angle 4 is equal to angle 8. Angle 3 is equal to angle 7 and angle 2 is equal to angle 6. This is about corresponding angles. And next, coming to the angles which are on the same side of transversal. Now, we are going to the uh, angles which are on the same side of transversal exterior. Now, this angle, uh, the, these same colored angles are pairs of exterior angles which are on the same side of transversal. Uh, exterior angles which are on same side of transversal uh, are angle 2 and angle 7 are one pair of exterior angles on same side of transversal. Angle 1 and angle 8 are uh, exterior angles which are on one side of transversal. The sum of two exterior angles is equals to 180 degrees. Now, coming to the interior angles on the same side of transversal. Indeed, here are same colored angles. Angle 3 and angle 6, angle 4 and angle 5. These angles, uh, uh, the sum of these angles is 180 degrees. And now I am going to explain you some more angles of this uh, uh, angles which are made by the transversal. Here the angles which are opposite to each other like angle 2, angle 4, angle 1, angle 3, angle 6, angle 8, angle 5, angle 7. These angles are vertically opposite angles. These angles are of same degree. And the next one is uh, the linear pair. In this, uh, 
in this transfer cell we have 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 8 linear pairs so a uh, linear pair is sum of these two angles is equals to 180 degrees now i wanted to explain you one more model that is angles and property of triangles uh, we know that this is a triangle and uh, now I am going to explain you angle sum property uh, of triangle which is uh, the sum of all the angles of a triangle is equal to 180 degrees. Now I am going to prove this angle sum property. I wanted to divide this triangle into uh, three parts uh, as shown here and we know that uh, the angle on any point of a straight line is equal to 180 degrees. Uh, now, I am going to arrange these three parts which are uh, divided by me in such a way that uh, they all meet at one point. Here you can see that these are uh, three angles which are arranged to be meeting uh, these vertices have uh, met at one point and they formed a straight line. Here we can conclude that the, the sum of these three angles is equal to 180 degrees as they form a straight line and the angle uh, on any point on straight line is equal to 180 degrees. Hence, we can prove that the sum of any any uh, sum of three ang three angles of any triangle is equals to 180 degrees if you want to draw any triangle the uh, sum of three angles of that triangle must be 180 degrees thank you